The Lenovo Yoga 720, uh, 13 inch. 13 inch, all right. Very similar to our 720, uh, 15 inch, but in a smaller size for people who want a little bit more of a uh, portable uh, series of the 700, 720 series. We've uh, also included Thunderbolt 3 support on this device, as well as USB-C and, and headphone, headphone jack. jack. You didn't take it away? Nope, no, no, we didn't take you it away. Do that, right? No, we didn't sacrifice thinness for that. Uh, on this side, you'll have your traditional USB-A for uh, legacy support, you know, traditional uh, USB-A uh, connections. And then uh, the display will also be available in 4K resolution. 4K and 13 inch. 4K and 13 inch, we'll also offer it in that. It will be available with the Intel 7th generation processor, uh, the ultra low volt uh, variant to be uh, a little bit more um, uh, calm on the thermals and that. Uh, it's the not heat. a Core M. It's not a Core M, it's Core i7 U, U series. And uh, uh, if you look around, so basically it's charging over Type C? Yep, charging over Type C. Uh, and charging pretty fast? Charges pretty fast, yep. It'll, it'll have all the, all the uh, fast charging capabilities. Uh, again, precision touchpad on the touch uh, touchpad here. You're going to get a consistent Windows uh, touchpad experience with Microsoft Precision Touchpad and a fingerprint reader comes standard with the device. So, what would you say for the consumer who's considering this one instead of the X1 Yoga Gen 2? Uh, this one will be coming at a lower price point than the X1 Yoga, of course. Um, the X1 Yoga is more of a premium business uh, device. This one is geared towards our consumer end. So it's going to come in at a lower price. The starting price on this will be 859 US dollars. 859. All right. Uh, nice, uh, thin and light. Yep. And if you close it all the way down. And is it also in April? Uh, this one will be available in April as well.